Today we chat about a unique rat, little ball of fat that people thought went splat, gonna mythbuster that. You might have heard about the little lemming, a rodent lives in the arctic, nothing. Tiny balls of fur, one thing disturbing, that when there's too many they get to shoving. Big droves of them off the cliff go jumping, to their doom they all be mad hopping. An insane ritual, suicidal shock coming, lost the will to live, brain needs a good thumping. Yeah, but it turns out this is a myth circulating. The lemmings ain't just doing body dumping. To the wind their little lives be throwing. When they get too many, they start migrating. Out of their burrows, they will go flooding. Some faraway land to which they be rushing. When they run out of land, they all start falling. Like that computer game we all were playing. A lot of the time, they just end up swimming. But they ain't suicidal, just not too cunning. Yeah. Early scientists thought they fell from the sky. For many years, scholars kept asking why. The furry little guys gave up with the sigh. Together they would rush to leap from up high. A Disney documentary made this myth fly. But I'm here to tell you, lemmings don't banzai. Just a misconception that we should deny. Yeah. That's right. Alright. Hey guys, it's Sam. How's it going? So, that was a bit of fun. Ooh, I forgot to show you the pictures during the rap. Ah, uh, that's okay. Here, I'll show you them now. So, uh, as you heard, I've been talking about them lemmings. Lemmings. Nope. Oh, look at them. Aren't they cute? Cute little lemmings. So that's them on the snow. Yeah, so lemmings, lemmings are very interesting creatures uh, in that they are not your typical color. Right, so, okay, lemmings are rodents. Okay, and rodents typically are you know a very a very plain color you know they want to camouflage they want to blend into the background yeah so not these guys these guys are vibrant and they are not timid they are aggressive yeah that's right you heard me they will they will bear their little fangs at you that's right so anyway let's talk a little about lemmings okay so as i mentioned they're rodents and they live in the arctic in the tundra so yeah you see this all this snow and ice okay that's why they're little round chubby buddies and they're furry you know it makes them perfect for living in this cold cold place so if anyone mentions the term lemming right what is the first thing you think of right you think of the computer game maybe or of these crazy crazy rodents that will you know flock together and commit suicide right so for yes the longest time um, lemmings were thought to be suicidal uh, that is that they uh, you know to get they, they had lost the will to live and they would all mass suicide by throwing themselves off a cliff through the sky into the water okay so a little bit about lemmings they are herbivores okay they live in burrows they don't hibernate even though they stay in very very cold places okay um, yeah so they mean they remain remain active uh, and uh, they are they are quite interesting quite interesting creatures so oh, look at that look at that they're cute okay so these little balls of fur um, have a habit they they have huge booms in population which may sometimes cause uh, you know a sudden influx and too many lemmings in a burrow so what happens is they will they will um, migrate together right when there's a lot of them they will suddenly go ah we've had enough of this let's go and so they will they will migrate in en masse you know when the population hits so you, every couple of years usually um, uh, I think roughly about every four years so that was that was why there was the belief that lemmings you know committed suicide see like this so you guys remember the game yeah that little lemmings game adorable yet incredibly stupid furry creatures yeah that's right uh, they don't look at all like this as you saw okay so yeah you remember let's bring back memories frantic little guys running back and forth you know and you gotta help them not die most of those look that hard okay uh, and they don't explode either. No. Okay. So, uh, yes. Yeah, so the the misconception of these poor little lemmings. Oh, look at the guy. So they swim. Yes. So the misconception goes back to uh, way back in fifteen uh, thirties. You know when a geographer by the name of Zeigler uh, proposed the theory that the creatures fell out of the sky during stormy weather. Okay. Because um, 
yeah, clearly he was you know he was out chilling in the forest when suddenly you know one of these one of these dudes went you know plop and he went ah okay so um uh, the uh, many historians have described these very curious creatures and over time it has um, yeah kind of created the uh, the belief that that uh, these guys are clearly a little bit a uh, little bit crazy and uh, will commit suicide mass suicide uh, by jumping off cliffs so uh, it has now been found that it is not a deliberate mass suicide okay where the where these lemmings voluntarily choose to die it's just that you know they they want to migrate and they want to find new plant new new uh, places to live and unfortunately sometimes in their hurry you know they they knock each other off some cliffs okay that's all and uh, you know, in a lot of cases, of course, when they when they go to find new places, sometimes they have to cross bodies of water. And if they happen to jump into a river or a lake, sure, that's fine. You know, they just swim across. Uh, but unfortunately, if they if they fall off a cliff and fall into the ocean, then uh, yeah, they're not they're not gonna reach the other side. So unfortunately, yes, a lot of them will die. Um, but yes, no. So uh, unfortunately, the um, the belief, the myth that lemmings like to commit suicide was um, further ingrained in us by this this film now it was made by Disney see Walt Disney back in 1958 okay and it was called this documentary as you can see is called white wilderness so I don't know if any of you guys can remember this but okay it's, it's very very old but in this they staged that's right Disney staged a scene of these lemmings you know jumping off cliffs yeah, that's right. I mean, people already believed it before, but it wasn't that widespread, you know, until this documentary came along, and you know, there, you know, suddenly everyone was like, "Oh my God, these creatures are terrible." Okay, but they're actually not. They're actually, they're actually just, you know, like regular voles and mouse, mice, and rats. You know, just a regular rodent, and um, yeah, they're trying to go about their lives. Yeah, you know, and just, you know, just every now and then, you know, maybe they'll. They'll have a have a migration, and some of them will will uh, you know go banzai skydiving. <coughs> you know, just jump off. There you go. Okay, uh, so there you go. Fun fact for the day. All right, and I uh, hope you guys are having a a uh, nice hump day. That's uh, Wednesday. Yeah, middle of the week. Uh, but I think for a lot of us, it's probably it feels more like the start. Right, going back into into our business, our place of work. Um, slowly, slowly, we're coming back, and I see a lot of cars on the road now. So, um, wherever you are, stay safe, drive safe, and uh, remember physical distancing. Okay, Sam out. <laughs>